I know you guys have seen me post about New Vision Nutrition. I have a bunch of these prepped meals. I have a bunch of them, a bunch of them in the freezer in the fridge. So I'm gonna have to prep for a few days, which is nice. NewVisionBody.com to check it out and even get yours. It's great for those who either don't have time to prep, who are traveling, or you just don't want to do it. So you have something that's set up for you right away. So you can check it out on there. So I'm just prepping my meals, a breakdown of what I'm doing for my cut right now. We have just protein source here <laughs> with some hot sauce, um, some spinach and turkey and hot sauce. <laughs> I got tilapia and spicy mustard and broccoli, beans and chicken. I do about six, seven meals right now. Also, I have a couple other things I have to go to the store to get because I don't have it right now. <laughs> kind of go over my, my current stack right now, what I'll be doing. I'm doing the regular BCAAs. So this is just by Forza One. I get this at Nutrishop. So just regular watermelon flavor. And so fish oil. Again, this is what I just get from, it's New Tech. So I get this from Nutrishop as well. Women's like a multivitamin. Going very strict on my diet for the first three weeks. Um, so that means I'm sticking with lean protein sources like the ones I showed you. Lots of veggies and then um, limited on carbs. So dropped my carb intake down from my regular macros, which was like three, I think I was doing about 364 grams of carbs daily. My lipotropic, which is my L-carnitine uh, tartrate, and my I'm stacking it with my thermo. This is going to stimulate the drop of fat. When you get that drop of fat, then you have the L-carnitine, which the L-carnitine is gonna take that fat and shuttle it to be used as energy. So you're gonna optimize your fat burn by doing these two together. Stack that I'm doing pre-cardio, vitamin D, <laughs> bones and immune system. I'm taking this with my pre-stack, my cardio in the morning as well. A lot of you already know that I don't do caffeine. I don't do pre-workouts because I'm already high energy as it is. For this particular mini cut right now, I'm gonna be adding in caffeine. No pre-workouts, but the caffeine I'm gonna be doing is gonna be coming from my thermo, and also coffee, <laughs> so black espresso. Doing this every morning before my cardio, flavoring it with the, the usual, I'm sure a lot of you get these, so the Safeway. I like the hazelnut and the caramel and the vanilla. Those are my favorite. I think those are the only ones that come in that. But I do a squirt of this with my black coffee and we're good, sugar-free. Also on my plan is limited amount of spices and herbs and so we're sticking with, what I'm just gonna be sticking with is Mrs. Dash seasonings. Simple, you don't have to think about it. Goes, they have so many great flavors. So these, my spicy brown mustard. I'm doing hot sauce, tapatio. I know a lot of you like this, the big one, get the big one. <laughs> and Walden Farm products. So this is the one I actually like the best, which is the pancake syrup one. So for sweetener, either Stevia or Truvia. So these little packets you can take anywhere with you and use them as needed. I'm limiting to dull seasonings right now. And again, like I said, it's going to be the first three weeks. So I'm just cracking down, challenging myself to this. and. I'm gonna go over my six pack bag. So this is the one I'm using right now. Pretty spacious up here. This is where I'm gonna keep all my seasonings and my supplements. I fit even my shaker bottle in there. So that works perfect. So the back opens up. So I can put all my pre prep meals. I can put four of them in here. Sometimes I can put more up top. So I got four in there. We have my fork in there and some of my sweetener packets. Put the ice packs in just like that. And uh, we're good to go. Let's zip that. Ta da! And then, of course, my hydro flask, my water. We're good. The goal is to drop my body fat percentage in this next three, four weeks. So I'm hitting it hard, it's gonna be intense. It's not gonna be the easiest, but I'm gonna be sharing it with you guys. I'm gonna have my good days, I'm gonna have my bad days, I'm sure, just like everybody else. Adding in a little bit more intense cardio than I usually do. <laughs> I'm doing about 45 minutes of cardio. It's gonna be a combination of high intensity and low intensity. You know you guys have heard about, heard of LISS, L-I-S-S. -S. Low intensity, steady state cardio. 
lists. <laughs> then we got hit high intensity interval training. <laughs> I dropped my camera in Punta Cana. It was in a little package or a little purse. It was all wrapped up, but apparently when it fell out of my hand, it still hit just perfectly on the lens that it is broken right now. So I have to send it in to get it fixed. So I'm resorting to my camera phone again. So today was the start, day one of my mini cut. So I am doing this mini cut for a couple reasons. Personal reason, just because I want to shred down, which I know I can. <laughs> I like a challenge. I like trying new things. We always doing the same thing over and over again, just kind of maintaining and eventually it gets old to me. I like new stuff, I like change. Doing this mini cut, then going back to normal, then doing a mini cut, going back and forth, you know, just playing with it. It's exciting to me. Today was cardio day only, so I'm making myself a big green salad. I'm going to be putting a tablespoon of extra virgin olive oil, some Evu, with some balsamic vinegar. And I'm going to be weighing out just the chicken for about four ounces to go into my salad. So weighed out my chicken from my new vision prepped meal. So I got four ounces. Go into me. Put that in there. Got ourselves the extra virgin olive oil. And balsamic. I'm going to add some onion and herb. Mrs. Dash to mine. Lot of you are gonna be asking no I'm not competing at least not right now it's just personal goals we can have those right <laughs> yes I do have a coach because sometimes a coach needs a coach I tend to put my own plans on the back burner sometimes because I have my schedule so busy and so crazy that I'm like oh, I'll get to it later so this way having a coach I can hold myself accountable to them and they can do my plan for me and I'll have to think about it and they can help me reach my goals so I am determined like I said I like a challenge I want to complete this and do this for myself so day one Super excited to share this with you guys and for you guys to follow me on my own journey because we all have a journey. So this one's going to be mine. <laughs>